It's now time for the top five plays from week four, brought to you by Play On Sports. Number five comes from Brandon Taylor of Brentwood Academy. He's going to bobble the football here on this punt and survive a huge hit, keeping his feet and then finding his way into the end zone for a 70-yard punt return score. It was all part of Brandon Taylor's master plan. He just threw off the timing of the kicking team. Brentwood Academy lamb base Pope John Paul II, 62 to nothing. We head west to the great state of California for number four. Clovis North in a close contest against Frontier here in the third quarter. In the end zone, touchdown Broncos. An absolutely indefensible play here. Arnold Lopez, nice two-handed grab in the end zone for a score, a great throw and an even better catch. And Clovis North goes on to defeat Frontier 38 to 21. Number three comes from Cameron Gray of Valor Christian. Watch the foot speed and cutting ability here. He wears out the X button on his joystick as he takes this one 67 yards to the house. Nobody can get a hand on him. He wouldn't have been brought down in a game of two-hand touch. Valor Christian goes on to win it 42 to nothing over Heritage. Three scripted plays from this Valor Christian offense and they are looking dangerous. Number two is an epic play from Tennessee. It's Charles Talleyrand of Rossview turning in his best Vince Young impression. Scrambling with time running out on the clock and his team trailing, runs it into the end zone for the game winning score. Rossville beats Kenwood 38-36 on the Talleyrand go ahead score in a play that typifies the emotion of high school football. Number one comes from South Carolina for the second week in a row. It's Ryan Davis, the sophomore defensive back of AC Flora, jumping this route and taking it to the house for a pick six, preserving his team's lead against Columbia, and he wasn't done. On the very next play from scrimmage, Ryan Davis does it again, turning in another pick six. That's two interception returns for touchdowns in less than 20 seconds, and he helps AC Flora hold on to defeat Columbia 48 to 20. That's two weeks in a row for the Palmetto State at number one. Check back next week to see if anyone can dethrone South Carolina as the top five plays of the week returns. Brought to you by Play On Sports, high school sports lives here.